What's good, YouTube? So we're now here in Hollywood at a location. We're about to go check out and see what kind of stuff they have here. They usually have a lot of heat. Hopefully they keep it up. So let's go ahead and see if you like what you see. Once again, smash that like button, you dig? On feet, Kyrie 8, Kyrie Infinities, man. Very happy to have these. Had to break them out right away, you dig? And the Rolling Stones, I like this, man. This hoodie looks pretty dope. Not really a big fan of vintage tees, but they do have some stuff here like that. Now we saw these for Christmas over at Jumpman. Now we have them here. Got the little images of the Jordans all over. Not at this colorway. One in 10 scale, what do you guys think about these? Not bad, bro. Got some all black blazers. Fire. We definitely seen this colorway before. I think this one is actually pretty dope. What do you guys think about these? Definitely something different, bro. Copper pass. 11s, 13s, 7s. The winter rises as well as those. These Air Forces before, I think they are pretty dope. I like the color combination. It gives me like a winter vibe. Very clean shoe. What do you guys think about these? And then we saw these last time we were here too, but these are clean. I've seen some people wear them on feet. Some of the uh, outfits they put together with these are definitely on point. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Air Max 95. We definitely seen these before. They still got some pairs left. These are fire. This is a dope colorway, man. What do you guys think about these? The, what do you call these? The grapes? Not the aquas, but these are the grapes, if I'm not mistaken. Air Max 95. So they got some of these Tims. You got the SpongeBob Tim with the SpongeBob on the tongue. Got the branding over here. I think that's pretty dope. Next to it, we got the Timberland, representing the Chicago Bulls. For the Timberlands wearers out there, what do you guys think about these? I think they are pretty dope. Got some all black Tims also. And then I don't even know about these. It's out of my league. Look at the look at the hoodie though, bro. Wow. This is pretty dope. Retail on this. 150. That's clean though. Then they got some paper planes. Look at that. A lot of dope apparel here. Look at these jeans. He was a coach at my school. I went to Santa Monica College. He was a track coach when I was hooping there. They still got some Halloween Prestos on deck if you guys are looking for these. 150 is the retail. You don't really see these too much often, you know what I'm saying? I think I spotted them a couple times at the outlet in smaller sizes, but these are clean, bro. They got a few sizes here too. But some of the stuff I do like, I used to have it before. Especially like the ice cream with the dog or whatever um, on the crotch area. I had a few pair of these back in the day. Some of them I will be getting again, hopefully. I don't know, some of it. I'm not really into it, but I do like it at the same time. So every now and then, you might see it, you might see it. But these are dope. Look at this with the stitched in the hearts. Ice cream, these are actually fire, bro. What's the retail on these? 215 though, that's why you won't see me with this. At least not yet, but those are clean, bro. I don't know what these are, but this is fire too, bro. Billionaire Boys Club. These new bounces are pretty fire. One in 10 scale, what do you think about these? These are clean. I'm not mad at these at all. Different colorways, the color combinations that they come with are definitely on point. Let me know what you guys think about these. 997H? Definitely dope. The jeans for Billionaire Boys Club with the rips and you got all these things on it. I guess this is the style now. I've been seeing that a lot more too. Billionaire Boys Club sweats. Very nice section for BBC. Along with some other things. You got Chicago. You got a lot of New Balances, bruh. If you're into New Balances, we could definitely get you right here. Colorways are just different. They just stand out a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? These are clean too. That material is nice. 998. Those look clean, clean, clean. Four, these are clean. You know, I'm a big fan of Prestos. These Prestos are definitely on point. They got some of these on deck. They got the sunset ones also for the ladies. I think this colorway is pretty far too. Prestos is definitely one of the doper, more comfortable shoes. They got Air Max 97s down there, Air Max 1s. Look at those Air Max 90s. Air Max 97, this orange colorway is definitely popping off the screen. One in 10 scale, what do you guys think about these? I think these are pretty fire. Those stand out a lot. We've seen these before in the store. They definitely stand out. 
These are definitely fire. The Vapor Max Plus for the women. That pink colorway. And then we've seen this yellow canary one also, man. All of these are some built colors for the ladies. I like what they did with these. Let me know what y'all think about those in the comment section below. Which colorway do you like the most? You guys already know what to do. If not, go ahead and join. Hit that join button next to the subscribe button. Or either just join me on the Discord and you can uh, level up that way. These New Balance 990s are fire too. Definitely fire. I never seen these Adidas or these Pumas before. These are pretty dope. Like the materials they use. They always use pretty good materials on the Pumas though for sure. Copper pass. Who's into this? It could be crazy. What do you think? Give me some honest feedback on these. Fire or trash? Uh-oh. I think we know some people who might want these. Pretty crazy. And they got some of these on deck, too. Yeah. Shout out to the LeBrons on deck, bro. These Vapor Maxes are pretty different, too. Some, like, utilities or something like that. The colorway is pretty dope. Got the green Vapor Max area, the bubble. Just wanted to talk about these. Look at these Air Max 90s. Of course, we've seen that colorway. This is my first time actually seeing this blue one, though. This one is fire. Blue or court purple, whatever that is. I think this is a dope Air Max 90. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Copper Pass. Got the gum also going on here. Another colorway of Air Max 90s. Pretty clean. Definitely a fall vibe for me. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Pretty clean. I'm a fan of these. Both colorways are fire. Of the two colorways you see in front of you, which one do you guys like the most? I think I would probably go with this one maybe first, but I do like that orange one. And of course, those pretzels just go without saying. Got some of these on deck too. In men's sizes and women's sizes, which is dope. You don't really find these too many places, bro. Let me know. They still have these on deck too, which a lot of people are sleeping on, but I wouldn't do that if I was them. The blue ones went up. These will go up too once people realize how dope these are and they want to get them later. What do you guys think? These damn meters snap. So yeah, you put 25 cents, you get like 10 minutes. So I, hopefully you guys are having a good day wherever you are watching this. Do me the favor, please hit the like button. Don't forget to, uh, you know, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Maybe follow me on Instagram. Maybe even check out the TikTok. Give me all the feedback. I like being in tune with you guys. I reply to all the comments. And uh, let's turn up for 2022, man. I appreciate y'all. I don't know if y'all can see that, but these meters be out here taxing. 25 cents only gets you two minutes or 10 minutes. So I put 45 minutes. I should be good. I already put 30 and I was still at the store for a minute. Had to come back and refill up. Now we're going back to the store. What do you guys think about these Air Force Ones for the ladies? This is not bad. Kind of creative. A lot going on here. Copper pass. Very light shoe. Air Force Ones are clean. I think I'm more a fan of this outsole right here. Pretty clean. One of the things, what do you guys think about these Air Max 90s? I think we have seen these in the stores before, maybe like a week or two ago. These are clean though. These Hirachis are clean. Got that like suede on there, a new buck on there with the mesh. Color combination is on point. Smiley face. One or ten scale, what do we think about these in the comment section below? Never seen these before. Strivers Row with the patch for a better world. See, so you can get real creative on these clothes now, man. A lot of this stuff wouldn't have been cool back in the day. This is cool though. These are kind of different. Oh, these are Chucks. I've never seen these before. Are we a fan of these or not? Two dope colorways. This one and this one. Which one do you guys like more? And uh, I think I do like these. These sweats are pretty clean right here. I'm a person who likes to wear sweats that you guys can see all the time. So this stuff like this would be for me. And maybe even something like this with the crab right there. Oh. Look at these Nipsey Hustles, bro. These are dope. Ralph Sampson TMC. The marathon continues. These are clean right here. One to 10 scale. What do we think about these in the comments below? R.I.P. to Nip. So they got those, and then they got these ones. These are also the TNCs, too. Boom. The gold on the back, very clean, bro. 
Puma selection is not bad either. We do have some people who be liking those. I'm a fan of Pumas. Some Pumas are dope. This colorway is pretty clean too. That green camo with the suede on there. Look at the materials on that. These are not bad actually. Got some different colorways down here. Gold. For those of you guys who think you got golden feet. A lot of clean stuff though, bro. These are clean too. I like the colorway. I like the uh, design of it. I like the extraordinary exterior and uh, interior, if you would say. That's pretty clean right here. These are dope. I haven't seen these before ever. If you guys have, let me know what you know about those. A lot of dope stuff, man. I really like this colorway. It's really popping off of the screen for me. This is where I found my LeBron hat. That one was dope. This grizzly hat is not bad either. Right here are clean too, bro. 130 on these. Fire, copper pass. Copper pass. Look at that patch right there, bro. Look at this one. This is actually super hard, bro. What? I know the price is gonna be super hard too. Hard to get 285 for the jacket, but this thing is crazy though. I don't know if we saw this the last time we were here or not. This thing is crazy, crazy, crazy. What is this, Bay No Boy Club? Oh, they got the they got the merch here. I know this stuff is a little bit more pricey, but it is fire, bro. 75 for that white and black one. Oh, that's clean. Get your closet right if you don't have it right already. If you want to add some stuff, definitely a spot you can come through and grab some heat. Like this colorway here too. This thing right here is clean. Proper pass on these. Being able to find these was dope and even better that I was able to find them for squad. What do you guys think about these? We weren't supposed to get them before. Now we do have them. This shoe is fire. If you know what the box is and you know what we saw in the video, then you know what the shoe is. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Box reads LeBron 9, black metallic gold, size 9. After getting them out the box, we have them right here. Very, very, very fire shoe. The LeBron 9 wash drones. LeBron 9 wash the thrones. Let me know your honest thoughts and opinions on these. If you guys were able to cop them yourself. The release was kind of tricky. Only found them at certain places. Once again, very happy to pick these up for squad. If you're somebody out there who wants to become a member, hit the join button next to the subscribe button on YouTube or go on and add yourself to the Discord Energy A10 and become a member that way. There's about three tiers to join. You might want to do that, but to each his own. What we're going to talk about though is this fire shoe, man. LeBron has always came with some fire shoes from different silhouettes, especially these nines right here. And I was fortunate enough to find these at a really dope spot uh, that shall remain nameless, you know, because I want to keep that spot low key and not have it killed by all these LA groups and stuff like that out here. So I will kind of keep it to the low ski, of course. But forget all that. That's a whole nother video. The LeBron 9 Watch the Thrones. I need to know your thoughts and opinions on these. 1 to 10 scale. Let's get these a rating right here. Very dope details to these, bro. Wow, man. The sock liner is crazy. Uh, if I would have found myself a size 13, maybe I would have scooped these and kept them for the personal. But I didn't. I'm not tripping off it. Got other things going on. These are ridiculous, though. I think they're a 10 out of 10 easy. There's a couple, one or two more LeBron lines that I might release. And uh, do me a favor in the comment section, what is your favorite LeBron silhouette? Maybe top three. I think the nines might fall in there for a lot of people, especially this shoe right here. You know what I mean? You got that uh, lace lock thing, which they tell you. They give you a warning, letting you know. Make sure you take these off. Do not hoop with these on. They're not meant to be on while you're hooping. They're more for casual wear. If you're somebody who wears basketball shoes for casual wear like myself, I would definitely keep these on very loud and outlandish. I think that's pretty fire. I think that's a dope detail to it. Both shoes have the same thing. There's no different details in either one of them. But yeah, once again, picked up two pair for the squad. Very happy to make that happen. Let me know what you guys think about these LeBron nines. Let's go ahead and get back to the video. So we were able to scoop up some heat for the squad once again. Feels great to be back outside. Let me show you guys what, well, if you guys see the box, you already know what it is. We're gonna talk about them when we get to the crib, of course, you dig? So we secured the bag for the squad. We'll talk about these when we get to the house. If you guys know the box, you already know what it is. Now we're getting back to the car to get out of here and get to some more spots. If you like what you see, make sure you hit that like button, y'all. Make sure maybe you share the video. And definitely make sure you're subscribed to the channel if you're not already. And uh, join the Discord Energy 810.
subscribe to the YouTube channel Bosco 2.0, Bobby Thrift, Instagram, Bosco's Goodies, all that good stuff, man. Tap in with your boy Bosco, man. I appreciate the support and energy. Let's go. Cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it. Cook it, cut it, measure it, measure it, crack. Cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it. Cook it, cut it, measure it, measure it, crack. That's that crack music. That's crack, young That's all you need. Here on Hollywood. I'm going to make this quick. We're going to go buy Foot Locker and Shoe Palace to see if there's anything worthwhile there really quick on our way to some other stores. Um, Back out here on Hollywood. Not looking bad. People's out, but it's still kind of early. I'm sure in about an hour, maybe 30 minutes, these blocks will be flooded. People are still out and about regardless of whatever's going on. Show you guys some of the selection that they got here at Hollywood and Highland. Nothing that we haven't seen before. Nothing really picking up to grab. Couple sales, couple red tags. You know what I mean? Uh, don't think I've seen this colorway before, all these 270s. How many people out there own 270s and still rock them? These are not too bad though. And I do like this colorway of the Air Max 95, I'm not even gonna lie. Color looks pretty crazy, pretty loud, but it is dope. Bad. Can I give you the number? Yeah. Um, 818? So when I decided to slide by Hollywood Foot Locker, I came across these, as you can see, the light smoke gray and gym red Jordan 1 Lowe's. We definitely talked about this before in adult sizes, but now the gray schools popped up. We were fortunate enough to grab one of these. Very clean, man. The metallic features, you know, on the uh, lace lock, plus you got the uh, accolades right here on the tips of this lace, which is pretty dope, man. What do you guys think about these? Copper pass. Um, I think these are pretty clean, you know what I'm saying? The resale, I guess if you're looking for resale, is not too bad with these. And the retail on these is actually very cheap, which is also fire. Only 85 bucks. A suede looks pretty good, right? One to 10 scale, what do you guys rate these? And did you guys pick these up in men or grade school? Let's get back to the video. You guys can see what they have on deck here on the Nike basketball wall. PGs, LeBron's on sale. You know what I'm saying? Got even these on sale for 99 bucks. I remember when I saw them for 79, I should have jumped on it. And then um, they got some more retros. The 13's still chilling out here, of course. Mids. Got some sixes here po posted up. And we got some 13's on deck. So we're continuing the same video, sliding on over here to the Grove. We're gonna go check out Nike and see if they have anything there worthwhile. So let's go ahead and see if there's anything that we like. Nike usually has some heat, so let's go ahead and see what's inside. So at Nike, there's not too much here today. From when I just looked around, you know, these are pretty dope though. I do like the colorway here. What do you guys think about this shoe overall, the Zoom GT? A lot of people do like it. I do see a lot of people in the NBA hooping in these too. If you got some sneaker uh, feedback on these, let us know in the comments below. Looks like they have a new colorway of the Giannis Immortality. This black colorway is pretty dope. Not mad at this, with the orange swoosh right there. One at 10 scale, what do you guys think about these? Now I'm confused if we've seen this one before or not. I feel like we have. I think I did a video on this before or something like that too. But the colorway is dope. The KDs are nice. They do that extra, you know, design underneath the upper mesh like the Kyries do. What do you guys think about these from a one at 10 scale? Got some more of these LeBron hoodies, which are dope. Really good quality on them. Nothing on the back. Pretty dope, bro. Hey, how you doing, bro? What's going on with you? Happy New Year to you too. Yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, bro. Yes. <laughs> these are fire, though. These are these are dope. Anybody out there still looking for these? Let me know in the comments below. These are pretty nice, bro. They got the 75th anniversary shorts here, bro. These is hard. Ninety dollars on the retail. Got that hologram right there. These are clean. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comments below. And if you guys like these, they're gonna cop them yourself, man. I think those are pretty fire. A lot of dope liquor apparel here. Anthony Davis jersey, LeBron jersey. They got the uh, Penny Magic, the Penny Orlando stuff. Of course, you know, I love that sweater. They got the shorts here too in both colorways. Pretty clean. Let's just go check upstairs really quick and see if there's anything in the kids or women's section worthwhile. They still got these hoodies on deck, bro. These Jordan hoodies, man. Super, super dope, man. Super dope. Super dope, bro. So 
So let's go upstairs. You got women and then you got grade school. We'll go ahead and see if there's anything there worthwhile. Dope Nike store, three levels, four levels actually. One, two, or three levels. Three levels, four levels. I get confused. At the end of the day, it's a dope store. If you're in the LA area, definitely should come and check it out when you have an opportunity to. So we see that the grade school gets all the love out here. Out here in LA, in the States, you're not really finding too many of the adult sizes in these Kyries, but they indeed have them in grade school. 110 on the retail. What do you guys think about these? Kyrie 8, Kyrie Infinity. You guys see I got mine on right now. But these are fire though. And then they got the uh, the KD Kyrie edition also, bro. They are definitely hooking the grade school up with these Kyries. This is the KD Kyrie 8. And then KD has a KD Kyrie 14, which is also pretty dope. As you can see, they have this colorway in grade school, the white and cement gray, which is dope. Only grade school available. I think this is only coming in grade school and they have it here. These, which are super dope. The aluminum, I believe these are called. Cannot wait to actually get these in my size. I have seen some people already talking about these already. I already have them on deck, but unfortunately they only have them in grade school right now. Last but not least, the Kyrie KD collab once again on the Kyrie 8. Now these are fire, bro. I don't even know what to say. Out of the three, it's kind of easy for me. Well, this is third, no matter what. <laughs> this gray one is cool, but it's it's number three for me. It's just not as impressive as the other ones are. But of these three in front, these two right here, out of these two, which one do I like the most? I don't know. Actually, I do know. I'm going with this first and then that one and then that one. Let me know if you guys agree, but I do love the detail to this one. Uh, the print all over print on the upper. I think these are numbers and things that have to do with the Kevin Durant. You guys can correct me. I'll find out more information on that. Of course, Elizabeth, his mom. Dope detailing to this shoe. I think it is really dope. I like the color combination too. Kind of gives me some OKC vibes too. I wish this panel was not white, but it is clean at the same time. Uh, one to 10 scale, honestly, honest opinion for this one. This is solid eight, eight and a half, man. Like, about, you know, it's in the eight range. You know, the lace, the lace option they came with is fire on this one. I like the outsole, the Brandon with the KD number. I like these, man, these are super dope. But these right here are just on a different level to me. The color combination, even with the white or sail that's in there, cause this out midsole is kind of sail, it's not necessarily white. Unless it's just my eyes playing tricks on me or the lighting. But these are clean, 10 out of 10. I'm definitely gonna cop these when I get my opportunity to, once I find these in adult sizes. So as I slid by Nike, as you saw in the video, I was able to go ahead and scoop this up too for a family friend. Actually one right here, uh, this Kyrie, uh, Kyrie 8, Kyrie Infinity in aluminum colorway, which is super dope, super, super fire crazy. Uh, picked this up for one of the homies. They need to get it a grade school size seven. That's what this is. There are no adult sizes released in the States just yet. Only grade school sizes, but these are crazy and they have the exact same materials. Let me know what you guys think about this colorway. The crazy colorway and detail of the shoe, man, it's on point. They definitely hooked us up with these Kyrie eights. I know a lot of people had mixed feelings about them, but uh, these are fire, bro. Let me know your honest thoughts and opinions on this colorway. Then we also was able to scoop this up for a squad member. They wanted one for their uh, kid also, size seven. This is the Kai D for, Ky for Kyrie KD, the Kai D, KY hyphen D. Uh, this is Kyrie's, Kyrie eight, obviously, uh, paying homage to uh, Kevin Durant. That's why you see the number seven right there for KD. You have these, uh, this print right here on this upper is super crazy. This is one thing that really stands out about the shoe. Very detailed. Is that a phone posit? Maybe, uh, like I said, I think these things are prints of uh, images of things that represent, you know, KD, Kevin Durant. Uh, but these phone posits, maybe KD was a big phone posit head growing up. If you're somebody out there who knows that, let me know. Yeah, this is for KD. There you, there you go to Texas Longhorn. We went to Texas. Dope situations on this, man. We definitely gonna get a review on the channel talking about this shoe so you guys can get a little bit more understanding like myself. And you have the green on the back. This colorway is crazy, man. One out of 10, I get these. These gotta be up there too, at least the nine and a half, man. Even the majority white goes perfectly with the shoe. I like the lace option color they gave you. Maybe trying some lace swaps like I like to do would be cool, but the way that they come factory is on point. The outsole is crazy. There's 35 for KD's O number. 
74's new number. Let me know what you guys think about these two Kyrie 8's. And of the two Kyrie 8 or Kyrie Infinities, which one do you guys like more? Let's get back to it. They got some Air Force Ones with some tumble leather on here. The color combination on these are not bad. What do we think about these? This is the Display 6Y. I don't even know the price of them, but probably like $90 or something like that. Copper pass on these too. These are pretty clean. Look like they would be very comfortable. They are kind of bulky, but they are pretty comfortable at the same time from what I've heard. Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. Got these on deck. Not sure if you guys are feeling anything you see here. Blazers, Blazer Lows. Then you got these Hirachis, which are pretty clean too. I like this color combination. Give me that old school retro vibe. Let me know if you guys are feeling this in the comment section below. We got these black and white Hirachis, which are pretty dope too. Not mad at these at all. Look at these. What do you guys think about these 95s? This colorway is pretty clean. I haven't seen it before. My first time seeing it. Let me know what you guys think. Do we got some 3M on these too? Little hints of 3M around the laces. A little bit on the back panel. Clean shoe right here. What do you guys think? Still got these on deck, which are definitely fire. It pops off the screen all day. What do you guys think about these reds in the comment section below? Damn. Okay. Vapor Max Plus. We've seen this colorway before, but it does look dark on camera. Don't you agree? <laughs> then you got the triple black ones. A lot of people do like the triple black Air Max Pluses. They go with anything and they are comfortable, look very stealth, copper pass. You can't go wrong with these. Sunset vibe all day. Then you got 97s here. And then check out this colorway. It reminds me a lot of those Griffies that came out recently. Copper pass on these. Got that fresh water green or whatever. Then you got those. Overall, a great selection here. Then they got these. Looks like it would be a 75th anniversary, which it is because it got that diamond on there. These Air Force Ones are not bad. Red, black, and gray colorway. 110 on the retail. What do you guys think about these? So many colorways of these, man. It's Air Max 21, so many colorways. Are you guys a fan of this model overall or not? As you see another colorway right behind it. And they look like they could be comfortable, but I'm kind of good on them. So uh, we definitely have seen these safaris before at the uh, WSS and a few WSSs. This colorway is pretty dope. What do you guys think about these safari themed Air Max 90s? For 130, bro. Air Max 90 SE, you can't go wrong with these. Got some Air Max Pluses in the white, majority white with some hints of color. These are going for 160. Copper pass on these for the ladies. I feel like we've seen these Air Max 90s before, but then again, I feel like not. Give me your feedback on these regardless if these stand out to you. And if you like what you're seeing, once again, smash the like button. We definitely seen these Hirachis before. I do like these myself. One in 10 scale, these are solid nine, 10, bro. These are fire. Got, got the little brown or gum also hints on there. Crazy, 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 crazy. Got a classic colorway. Then we got these Hirachis. Now this colorway is fire too. I like the materials on here. Hirachis is a very comfortable shoe. Definitely a staple in the Nike community. Let me know what you guys think about those. And then we have some Air Max 90s that I haven't seen yet. Got like some design on the Nike swoosh. Got the stitched in around the Air Max logo. These are clean. Copper pass, one in 10 scale. What do you think? I feel like these might have some 3M on them. Let me put a light on the C. I was right. So this whole Nike swoosh lights up when you put a light on it. That's pretty dope. This adds a whole different element to the shoe. On both sides, copper pass, man. These are pretty dope. Women's section. They got these daybreaks in the shimmer colorway, the gold shimmer, to go with the Air Max 97s that we've seen. Kind of also go with those dunks that recently came out. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you think about these in the comment section below. These craters, this burgundy and white with the little hint of the pink is pretty dope. What do you guys think about these? Uh -huh, no problem, no problem at all. Now we've been seeing these Air Force Ones around a little bit and I have to say that this color combination on these are pretty dope. One in 10 scale, what do you guys think about these in the comment section below? I think these are pretty dope though. Uh, seen some women wearing them and they look good on feet. They're not hard to, uh, to match with because of the majority black. But that's just my opinion, let me know what you guys think. For the women's section, never really seen these Georgia before. Not too many times. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below for the ladies? Retail is 150 on these things. The colorway is not bad. Definitely a fall vibe all day. 
Definitely will keep your feet warm. Quality on these definitely look on point. Look like it's a comfort or something like that. One at 10 scale, what do you guys think about these? Then they also have some dunks for the women. Retail for 120. Colorway is not too bad. Let me know what you guys think. We'll take a step back from the rest of the wall. Pretty good selection of shoes, just depending, of course, like I always say, what you're looking for. If you see something you like, let me know, comment about it in the comment section below, you dig? I already know what it is with these. Kyrie's while getting, while wearing Kyrie's, that's how we do. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get out of here though. There wasn't too much else in here. I mean, we did find some stuff at the other location. I did get some stuff here, as you guys can see. Hopefully, uh, you guys enjoyed what you see. If you did, smash the like button, share the video. We're going to get home and wrap it up and talk about everything we came across. Uh, but I just want to say what's up and big shout out to you guys for watching this long. And if you are still watching, hashtag CB34. If you're watching right now, hashtag CB34. Let's me know how far people got into the video and if you guys are even paying attention. You dig? So we found two bangers. We're going to go ahead and talk about these when we get to the crib. <laughs> you already know what that is, bro. Pretty fire, copper pass. Now we definitely seen this before, definitely talked about this before. I'm just a fan of it. I think it is pretty fire. The blue, the red, the clearness of the bubbles. These are ridiculous. One to 10 scale, what do you guys think about these? People have been going crazy for these mids in general. This is a size 10 for the toddlers or PS, I think it is. What do you guys think about this colorway in the comments below? I think this one's pretty fire, bro. Pretty fire, bro. What do you guys think? This one here, which is like white and navy blue. For the kids also, pretty clean. 11C is the size. What do you guys think about these? So we got some more of the waffle ones. I like this color combination. Definitely gives me undefeated vibes. What do you guys think about these? Copper pass, they have that colorway, as well as this one. Not too bad. Got the grind material. Like I said, overall, pretty dope situation. You know what I mean? If you guys like what you see, you gotta smash the like button, share the video. I say that so many times, but that's what we do on YouTube. Button. You gotta share the video. You already know the vibes. This is how we get down. Got Kyrie Ace on deck, if you guys did not know. I said it for five, six times already because I love these shoes. These things is crazy. Definitely have some people asking about them. Very, very clean, bro. I like them. I'm happy with them. Very dope. With this Nike situation, this shirt is pretty tough. Oh, they got, they got them folded out right there. It's like a blazer with a candle lit. That's fire. Nike with the ice cream cones. Okay. I see what they did. You know what I mean? Not too bad. But let's go ahead and get out of here. I'll meet you guys back at the house. We'll talk about everything we came across today. Let's go. So briefly wrapping this up, because I know it's been a long video, which I hope you guys did enjoy it. Hit the like button if you did. This is what we came across today in today's video for squad and others. I think this was a great day, man. Let me know what you guys think. And of these shoes, which one do you guys feel like is the best find? Watch the Throne, the Kyrie's, or the Lowe's? I mean, I think a lot of people might go with this Watch the Throne, because this thing is just so dope and sought after. Very dope day. Happy to find these shoes, man. I really enjoyed doing this. Back out here, pretty much my first time for 2020. 22, been sick and all that stuff so i had to just chill out and make sure i was good even after i felt better so now we back at it man if you guys like what you saw in the video of course hit that thumbs up share the video and don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel with the notification bells on it's your boy bosco more videos to come subscribe have a great night wherever you are in the world deuces